dog. I love something that makes me talk something. It's a song that made me think. So props to that. Next one of you guys, number five from Lady Poetic. This is Mad Lion. This guy is this the the reggae hip hop dude? Yes. Oh fuck! I oh, see I'm so short. excited. <laughs> I see short. I see shorts of this guy, and I just fucking lo- I love that whole fusion. I love it. He's an old guy, right? Like yeah, in his sixties. This, this is early, early nineties, if not late eighties. Okay. Too many yeah. suckers and not enough time to walk up all of them with one clip from me nine. Too soon to kill them, say me don't care. I tried to chill, but did not get me no way. I just put on me gun in a baby suitcase. Pick up me fist, me both have them face. Flip, script, one of my head flick. Boom, bop, one and one shot no liquor. Don't do so once again. Be this thing which we bad boys them. And if you are bad boy, not a guy can tie. Let me see the fist them. It's like sticky fingers with reggae vibes. Rats the sticky fingers. Find where he was, what, where he was born, or uh, when he was born. But he's London, England. He was born in London. But it doesn't say what year. Maybe he's an alien. <laughs> I mean, I guess early fifties, maybe. Yeah, you think so? Like. Uh, He's probably pushing like, <coughs> like pushing seventy. I don't think he's that old. Sixty. Probably pushing sixty if I had to guess. What is he? Is he the guy who's? Where's the? What's the? What's it called again? 
Well, Rastas wear them around their braids. Um, well, he's got a bandana around the dreads and some older videos. I don't but know. But isn't there a, isn't there a word for what they what the Rastas wear? Yeah, I don't know what it braids? is. I don't know what it is either. I'm too ignorant. But uh, the videos that I've seen of him like spitting freestyles on YouTube, he looks like he's a seven year old man. Now I'm not sure if we're thinking about maybe it's a different person I'm thinking of. I'm not sure. There's some. There's something on YouTube, and I'm confused about it, where it's like all these like reggae influence and influenced freestylers spinning verses like on YouTube shorts, and it all says Mad Lion. But there's a whole bunch of different artists that all it is as Mad Lion started like an online community for like Rasta influenced hip hop freestyle verses. I'm not yeah, sure, no, interesting. but it's, it's something that I've noticed that I'm kind of confused about. Hmm. <laughs> if someone knows, let me know because I've seen Mad Lion on lots of videos, and even females, like a female, you'll say Mad Lion, whatever. Okay, interesting. Huh. So I think he, I think he's kind of like a like an artistic entrepreneur of some kind, kind of like myself, like our, our right. like bu- building building teams and building groups to all with the same kind of cause, kind of like my whole life, what I've always done, like Spit Boss and fucking my my work and my podcast and all the stuff that we do building cool. teams. Um, Mad Lion, I love it. I love how he's like screaming at the top of his lungs that I love that shit. Like, like is Fredro star does it. Sticky fingers does it. He sounded like Rasta's sticky fingers. It was dope. Um, I'm going to give that a nine. What do you say? Okay. So, um, yeah, I, I think another classic track. Um, just wanted to bring something from back in the day to the table. High energy. Oh, yeah, you brought Once this. Again. I thought I thought this was Vincent for a second. Well, um, a, a rest in peace, Mad Lion, Preggy. Um, oh, Mad Lion passed away. Yeah, I didn't know that either. Because he Fuck. did something with Onyx not too long ago. They did something like not two, three years ago. So he passed away in the last five years probably. But, so that's, that's recent then. Yeah, what a shame. But yeah, um, <laughs> did some work with, um, you know, KRS One back in the day. Yeah, a lot of stuff in the early '90s. So, yeah, I, I think it's pretty dope. I'm gonna give it a 8.5. 8.5, 100 want that on the playlist. Let's get into the final matchup, the second or the last song of the evening, guys, is from Jeru the Damager. J- is it Jaru? Jeru. 